Welcome to Campsie Parish Church and to our service of Holy Communion on this fourth Sunday of Easter. As we go through the service, please join in in the words that appear on the screen. The Lord has prepared a table for us. Our cup overflows. His goodness and mercy are ever before us. And follow us always. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Happy are they who find refuge in him. Let us pray. Almighty God, to whom all hearts are open, all desires known, and from whom no secrets are hidden, cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. St Paul set the scene. Let us remember it now. The tradition which I handed on to you came to me from the Lord himself, that on the night of his arrest, the Lord Jesus took bread and after giving thanks to God, broke it and said, this is my body, which is for you. Do this in memory of me. In the same way, he took the cup after supper and said, this cup is the new covenant sealed by my blood. Whenever you drink it, do this in memory of me. For every time you eat this bread and drink the cup, you proclaim the death of the Lord until he comes. The Lord serves the table, table, a banquet for our souls. With bread and wine, he fed his disciples. In his hands, the stuff of earth becomes the food of heaven. In the same way, I take these elements, our daily bread and common wine, and they are transformed by his presence, made timeless by his spirit, nourishment for our souls. And as he gave thanks and blessed, let us draw near to God and offer him our prayers and thanksgiving. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Lift up your hearts. We lift them to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give our thanks and praise. And so we offer you our thanks and praise. God our Father and Creator, through Jesus Christ your Son, our Shepherd and Redeemer, for rest and nourishment in pastures green, for guidance in right paths and comfort in dark places, for blessing and mercy all the days of our lives. And so we join our voices with angels and archangels and with all the company of heaven to proclaim your glory, forever praising you and saying, Holy, Holy, Holy Lord, God of power and might, Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. He walked among us as Lord and as servant, as guide and as shepherd, to secure us, to sustain us, to restore us, to redeem us. In want he feeds us, in darkness he comforts us, in distress he heals us. He prays for us always and makes a place for us, that we might live with you now and forever. And you are faithful, O God, and so we have faith that he will come again to lead us in pastures new. Remembering now his work and passion, and pleading his eternal sacrifice, we follow his example and obey his command. Send down your Holy Spirit, we pray, to bless us and these your gifts of bread and wine, that the bread which we break may be for us the communion of the body of Christ, and the cup of blessing which we bless, that we receive in them by faith, may be made partakers of his body and blood, 
with all his benefits to nourish us and help us grow in grace to the glory of your most holy name. And at this table, as you offer your own flesh and blood, we offer our very selves, hands and hearts, and a sacrifice of praise dedicated to your purpose through Jesus Christ, our Saviour, who lives and rules with you and the Holy Spirit, one God now and forever. Amen. Following Jesus' example and in obedience to him, who on the night when he was betrayed took bread, and when he had given thanks, broke it and said, this is my body, which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way, he took the cup, saying, this cup is the new covenant sealed by my blood. Whenever you drink it, do it in memory of me. Take eat this is the body of christ which is broken for you do this remembering him this cup is the new covenant sealed by christ's blood which was shed that the sins of many might be forgiven Drink from it, all of you. Though we walk through the valley of shadow, we will fear no evil. The peace of the Lord will comfort us. The peace of the Lord Jesus Christ be with you. Let us pray. Father of all, we praise you for Jesus, our shepherd, who answers our want, who makes us to lie in green pastures and leads us beside still waters, who restores our souls and leads us in right paths for his name's sake. We thank you that he is with us always, feeding us, protecting us, healing us. We rejoice in him. May that goodness and mercy which follows us all the days of our lives be our gift to your world, that as we dwell in the house of the Lord our whole life long, others may come into the fold, drawn by your love of us and in us. And now, may the blessing of God Almighty the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be with you and remain with you now and forevermore. Amen.